Elizabeth Haas Edersheim, McKinsey's Marvin Bauer, Vision, Leadership and the Creation of Management Consulting. Discover the incredible journey of Marvin Bauer, the visionary leader who played a pivotal role in shaping the management consulting industry. In the book, McKinsey's Marvin Bauer, Vision, Leadership and the Creation of Management Consulting, author Elizabeth Haas Edersheim offers a comprehensive look at Bauer's life and accomplishments, as well as the pivotal moments that sparked his revolutionary ideas. This summary will delve into Bauer's principles of leadership, the innovative strategies he implemented at McKinsey and Company, and the impact his work had on the world of business. Marvin Bauer, A Life of Integrity and Humility Marvin Bauer's life was guided by principles of honesty, humility, and respect for others. Born in 1903 in a middle-class family in Ohio, he went on to attend Brown University and Harvard Law School. He married his high school sweetheart and they had three sons. Throughout his professional career, he preferred to be called Marvin and expected the same of his employees. He worked for the law firm of Thompson, Hine and Flory during summers. Marvin Bauer lived to be 99 years old, passing away in 2003, leaving behind a legacy of ethical and humble leadership. The Legacy of Marvin Bauer Meet Marvin Bauer, an exceptional lawyer and businessman whose vision revolutionized the world of consulting. Armed with degrees in both law and business, Bauer joined the esteemed law firm Jones, Day, Revis and Pogue, where he initially specialized in reorganizing bankrupt companies. He learned that artificial constraints created by status and hierarchy often kept CEOs from the right information they needed to make informed decisions. This led to Bauer's lifelong battle against such constraints, advocating for open communication and truth in business leadership. In 1933, Bauer joined McKinsey and Company and helped coin the term management consulting to describe the company's new purpose. He managed the firm's New York office before being elected managing director in 1950, where he worked with powerful companies like the White House under President Dwight D. Eisenhower. Bauer's clear vision on building consulting from scratch came at the right time, and he continued to make a lasting impact long after his formal retirement in 1992. Bauer's legacy is one of institution creation and leadership, providing valuable lessons for professionals across all industries. His books, The Will to Manage and The Will to Lead, remain timely and relevant today, as they reflect Bauer's belief that preparing succession plans is an important part of great leadership. The story of Marvin Bauer is an inspiring one, showcasing the importance of vision and the relentless pursuit of excellence in one's field. A Visionary's Ethical Model A new type of professional service firm that provides unbiased management consulting to major businesses was the vision of McKinsey's founder, Marvin Bauer. He believed in adhering to a set of high ethical business standards in pursuit of long-term benefits, rather than short-term gains. McKinsey's success depended on the behavior and conduct of its consultants and their ability to align with the company's values. To achieve this, Bauer recruited the best MBA graduates to maintain and project the firm's values consistently across all its offices. As a result, McKinsey is renowned for its deliberate consistency and reliability in providing unbiased management consulting services to the most prestigious brands. McKinsey and Company's Growth McKinsey and Company's expansion from a small firm to a global consulting powerhouse was not without its challenges. Marvin Bauer, the firm's leader, faced tough decisions such as incorporating the firm to solve liabilities and funding issues, expanding internationally, and deciding against going public. Bauer's commitment to integrity and maintaining the firm's strong professional culture were crucial in successfully navigating these challenges. McKinsey's expansion contributed to making business a respected profession, and its consistent branding and staffing with top talent led to serving Europe's top corporations. Bauer's selflessness and dedication to the firm's future ensured its continued success. Marvin Bauer's Leadership Strategies Marvin Bauer, former managing director of McKinsey & Company, is a testament to true leadership. He voluntarily stepped down after 28 years and allowed younger leaders to take the reins, 
proving his values were not about hoarding power for himself, but about the success of the firm. Bauer's leadership was guided by six core values, putting the client first, staying humble, consistency, fact-based decision-making, inspiring subordinates, and emphasizing the firm's values in every action. His timeless strategy for decision-making includes determining the need for the decision, gathering relevant facts and opinions, developing alternative solutions, creating an implementation plan, assigning responsibilities, and following up to ensure success. Bauer was also a vocal critic of the unethical marriage between auditing and consulting, a viewpoint that resonates in today's public accounting industry. His legacy of ethical and value-driven leadership still influences McKinsey and company today, making Bauer a true example of timeless leadership strategies. Marvin Bauer's Leadership Legacy In the mid-1950s, Marvin Bauer, a lawyer and consultant, was hired by Royal Dutch Slash Shell Group to implement significant changes in its centralized command structure. Bauer's success in Venezuela paved the way for a complete overhaul of the company and set an example for future engagements. In 1979, Bauer stepped in to lead a team of partners from McKinsey & Company in Price Waterhouse to craft a strategy for the accounting firm. Bauer recommended overhauling the way Price Waterhouse treated its employees, increasing decision-making authority of its partners, and adopting a new marketing message. Those recommendations helped Price Waterhouse avoid the questionable practices that plagued the accounting industry 20 years later. Bauer also strongly disagreed with Harvard President Derek Bach's criticism of Harvard Business School's case study method of teaching. He led a group charged with developing a response and crafted a report that gained Bach's respect and validated the case method as a teaching tool. Bauer's legacy is apparent in the leaders who passed through McKinsey, including Harvey Golub, the CEO of American Express, and Don Gogol, chairman of the investment firm Clayton, Dubillier and Rice Incorporated Bauer's leadership offers an example for future generations to learn how to lead in an empowering way. Marvin Bauer's groundbreaking vision and extraordinary leadership drove the creation of the management consulting industry and transformed McKinsey and company into a powerhouse in the world of business. By prioritizing strong ethics, unbiased advice, and a commitment to surpassing client expectations, Bauer's philosophy of corporate well-being echoes through history. Through the lessons that this book summary has condensed, it is undeniable that Bauer's impressive contributions to the business world continue to serve as rich sources of inspiration for leaders across various professions. His unwavering dedication to advancing management practices remains an invaluable asset in understanding how to lead and build successful businesses.